Janice Edroff has undergone a second surgery today to put some hardware into her spine. While the pain is greater than she's ever been through, her attention is diverted to something more important in her mind. Czech News traveled to Vancouver on Friday to bring wishes of a speedy recovery. We miss you, Janice. See you soon. Hey, Janice, how are you doing? Uh, I watched you on TV a little bit last night. Messages from far away, classmates from Dunsmuir Middle School wish her well. Janice, give me a call so I know how you're doing. Janice Edroff would rather be doing homework like other 13-year-olds than nervously await the outcome of a second surgery at BC Children's Hospital in Vancouver. It's a surgery that comes with plenty of risks. Right now, I'm more worried about being paralyzed because... I'm not quite ready for that yeah. yet and stuff. And plus, I need to do a lot of things. One week ago, doctors removed several screws from her spine. Then they put in leg bone from a donor, and the hope is that it fused the way it should. This week's surgery is to put more screws in after her spine started to collapse. It's a risk associated with her rare disorder called neurofibromatosis, where tumors grow along her spinal column. By raising money for Variety, the children's charity, the Edroff say Janice is able to keep her mind away from the excruciating pain. This little girl has made, you know, touch so many people's hearts that they care back. And that's so, you know, so wonderful for her. Janice's dream is to reach a fundraising goal of $1 million this year. And the Edroffs believe in their hearts this can happen. If we can do it before uh, the telethon, that would be great because it would mean less work for Janice. And she's got a lot of recovery to do afterwards. It would be really nice to see that as a Christmas present. Maybe by the time we get out of the hospital, one million dollars will be already there. Ninety-six thousand three hundred and seventeen dollars. How about that, Vancouver Island? Thank you very much. The Show of Hearts Telethon is February 16th and 17th, but Variety, the children's charity, is bracing for a lot of donations on their website, all because of Janice. She has an ability to communicate and. Um, move you to action that, that I have not seen in any other child, let alone adult. As far as Janice is concerned, being an inspiration is just fine with her. But you're the type of kid that you will do 